While 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 celeb Mohamed Abdelhamed is now a self-proclaimed fitness model, why Verilano's still figuring out how things between the two went so sour, and they may be the worst pair of their season. Their installment of the hit show had a spectrum of admirable and questionable couples. Most seem to be enjoying their new lives together. Favorite cast members like Guillermo Royer have been busy with their careers. Since the season's informative tell-all episodes, these alums are also building happy, healthy families. Some duos have already had children together. However, certain relationships are on the rocks, or over entirely. It's interesting to learn about their lives in 2023. Guillermo Royer Cara Base Since Guillermo married Cara in the United States, he's been improving his English and concentrating on his work. The relaxed man has recently taken up kayaking as a hobby. He's enjoying the exercise and the great outdoors. Now, the Venezuelan-born man is a father to his and Cara's six-month-old son, Nicolas Antonio. Guillermo has two jobs to support his wife and child. Cara revealed that Guillermo has a sales career, and also works in the hospitality niche. Though Cara reported being unhappy during her marriage while pregnant with their son, she's stuck by her husband. The young couple is taking everything day by day. They're learning to compromise for the sake of their new son, and their equally treasured relationship. While Guillermo remains more of a private type, Cara has taken strides in her career as an influencer, while caring for their son, born in November 2023. Emily Bieberly Kobe Blaze Finally settling into their married life with the birth of their second child, Kobe and Emily showed their fair share of red flags throughout their season, but the couple's still together. From Emily often acting like a toddler, to having her family buy her engagement ring, one would think the odds weren't in the couple's favor. Luckily, Emily and Kobe are prepared to tackle the world together. They're doing their best to raise a happy family. Sticking to a traditional lifestyle, Kobe works at an asphalt business, while Emily stays home and cares for the children. Patrick Mendes Thais Ramon Since their season, the partners have welcomed a beautiful daughter named Elise into the world, the November after they revealed Thais' pregnancy during the tell-all. Although Patrick and Thais have a successful relationship, Thais must deal with the disrespect of his brother, who still detests him. He feels jealous, but Patrick lets him off the hook each time. Patrick works for Vivint Smart Home, where he's employed as a general manager. In the meantime, Thais concerned with being an Instagram model and building her fan base. Jibra Miona Bell Although this couple faced hardships after announcing their relationship to their respective families, Miona and Jibra remain strong. The musician and his influencer wife have been making some serious bank in their respective careers, but haven't mentioned starting a family yet. For now, they're happy with their adorable Pomeranian fur baby. Jibra also openly lives a lavish life, perhaps due to his time on 90 Day Fiancé, but warns fans about the pitfalls of fame. Jibra's mother refused to attend their wedding. Also, Miona became controversial on social media for styling her makeup and hair in a way that sparked blackfishing accusations. However, nothing seems to stop them. Moving from South Dakota to Southern California, Miona and Jibra are admirably chasing their dreams, side by side. Muhammad Abdelhamed Yvette confronted the infamous Muhammad Abdelhamed after the pair were filmed for season 9's Tell All. His fiancée caught the man messaging another woman, and though they attempted to mend their relationship, the pair ultimately called it quits. After not posting on social media for months, there was speculation about issues in the relationship, like domestic abuse, but that wasn't proved. After Wive filed for divorce, Muhammad concentrated on his fitness, modeling, and influencing career. This fueled speculation that he may return in the single life. Yvette Arellano Yvette finally filed for divorce from Mohammed after being cheated on, and is working with an attorney to expose her ex-husband for immigration fraud. 
As part of one of the least compatible couples to ever be on the show, Wive already seemed quite unhappy. She didn't appear to enjoy having to deal with Muhammad and his poor conduct while they were still together. Therefore, it was encouraging when she decided to leave him for good. Perhaps Wive could appear on a future season of The Single Life, and prove how much better off she is without the stress of being with Muhammad. Bilal Hatsi's Shaida Sween Bilal Hatsi's might be one of the oddest people from 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 and the other way, but he and Shaida are still joined at the hip. The frugal man is still afraid that his wife is a gold digger. He refused to share any funds with her, essentially forcing her to sit at home. Bilal found work as a real estate agent, after spending nine years as a firefighter, and seems happy with his job switch. He's making sure that he stays financially stable, as that's important to him. Their unbalanced dynamic, and Bilal's stubborn nature, remain intact. The husband isn't giving Shaida a son, despite signing an agreement to have a child together before she turns 40. Shaida remained patient with her new husband after they married at the end of the season, and immediately took a spot in the spin-off, Happily Ever After? Even as a peaceful yoga instructor, Shaida is less content about the couple's unity than Bilal. Shaida's career ambitions have been put on the back burner, as she waits for Bilal to have a child with her. While she remains popular, Shaida was accused recently of running a scam. Despite this, Bilal remains the troublemaker in their relationship. Ariella Weinberg While there was speculation that Ari and Biniam were splitting up after season 9, the couple is still together. Things may not be perfect for the newlyweds, but they're on the right track to having a great marriage. They've moved from New Jersey to Iowa. Biniam continues his work as a physical trainer, while pursuing his dream of becoming a fierce MMA fighter. He wants to prove his strength, and give back to his community. On RSN, she lists herself as a television personality at Sharp Entertainment, aka 90 Day Fiancé's production company, but is mainly an influencer on social media.